Hi, this is Jim Sackman, your Focal Point Business Coach, and this time we're talking about communities of interest. Um, so I've, I use communities of interest as a way of describing the groups and um, social groups and around a common bond or interest that form on social media. Um, and that's really the strength of social media as uh, in all ways, as ways of sharing content as also as marketing and advertising. Because if you can develop a large number of followers around your company, then you've really got a huge community of interest, which can provide uh, lots of support for your business economically. On the other hand, that's also the inherent weakness of social uh, media marketing. You know, how do you get thousands of people to care about what a business has to say? So if you're a social, uh, socially conscious business or a socially directed business, a charity or some sort of messaging organization, that's one thing. But what if you're a business coach in Northern California like me? Well, I try to provide educational snippets which help people uh, relate to what I'm talking about, understand my messaging and value. So the thing is, is there's a way to leverage the power of social media that many people don't think about, and that is to combine the notion of social media and referral marketing. And that is to find a partner that wants to serve the same common community of interest that you'd like to serve. By sharing an offer together, whether that's a, a, an, a, some kind of coupon or discount or freebie, um, and then both promoting that to your social media uh, groups, then you can add up with a lot of power uh, added together. And that's really a way of exchanging and growing each other's marketing presence via social media. Um, and there's another kind of power in this activity, which is, of course, uh, that all this social media promotion requires advertising dollars. And the more you spend in a common place, the two of you spend, then the better off you both are by providing that leverage. And one last thing, and that is that social media is also all about narrow targeting of markets. So, you know, the, not huge numbers of people, but very targeted people. And this is, and by doing this and promoting just to that demographic, then you've created a lot of efficiency in your marketing by promoting just to that kind of ideal client that you're looking for. So I hope this helps, and this is Jim Sackman from Focal Point. Change your business, change your life, and have a great day.